Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Welcome back guys. So today we're gonna be doing um, a little challenge, Never Have I Ever. Um, Jayla made us these really cute little things. So I just feel like, you know, we want us to kind of play some games and kind of show you guys a little bit like what, you know, our little secrets. We're not gonna go too far. What we're gonna do is much These questions can. are not like, they're not bad, but you know, Gotta keep it G for the people who watch us. Let's get started. So let's get into this. Yes. Never have I ever. So the first question: Have you ever been stood up on a date? Have ever been stood up on a date? Have I ever been stood up on a date? I have. <laughs> I have never. What? Okay, uh, well you're gonna have to allow me. Don't tell the so the guy. Honestly, no, I'm not gonna tell. This guy had asked me if I wanted to go on this date or whatever, oh and I was like, you know, I really didn't really want to go. Like it wasn't like I have to go, I have to go, I have to go. So I like didn't really want to go. So I was supposed to go to like Top Golf or something like that with him, and then like I was checking in to make sure like the time and everything was still okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he didn't text me back, so I guess I got <laughs> But it's okay. I didn't really want to go anyway. Oh, I remember that. He wasn't that cute. No, he was not cute. Was not cute. And uh, like, I tried to text him. Like, he tried to text me the next day, and I didn't respond. What the heck was he saying the next day? Please elaborate. What did he say the next day after standing you up? I think he was like, you know, hey. And I was like, blocked. Because <laughs> you're crazy. You know what, let's just go to the next question. Let's... Have you ever been arrested? <laughs> okay, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. These are first. first. You go first. <laughs> so, and like the girls that I was involved with at this time, shout out to you all because I just want to say that y'all were all G's throughout that entire situation. We were young. We were scared. Um, but anyway, so it was like me. Um, and like three other girls that I was with. So when I was in the eighth grade, I believe it was in the eighth grade, I went to I went to I went to one of my friends' house and we went to go and you know we were going over there to spend the night. Well, you know, we weren't doing what we were supposed to do. Um, one of the girls wanted to like go to like see this guy, so we were like, you know, you're not going by yourself, plus we couldn't drive, so we were like, we'll walk. Like it was like up the like in my head, driving distance is really was up the street and around the corner. But walking, it was up the street, around the corner, down the highway, and onto like another street. I so honestly. it was very, very, it was very, very tricky. Anyways, I remember like every car that would, um, you know, pass by, I was legit like so scared that I would hide into like a bush or something. I saw like the lights of this car and something told me like do not hide so like I did not hide I did not hide and I remember like I remember this like was yesterday because I was like you have got to be effing kidding me like I saw the freaking police and I was like you gotta be joking the police pulls up and he's like where are you guys going and where we live like there's like there was like this curfew that had just been established where yeah. you were like it was 12 o'clock and you were under 18, 18 you had, you to, be had to be inside like they they did that for our whole county so the man that was, was stupid because I don't think it still applies now I don't know but the guy was like you know where are you going and so I was like well um I, well, one of the girls was like, you know, we were just like, we were on our way home. And like, we legit were like, we turned around and like started walking home. He was like, wait, 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 how old are you all? Or any of you all 18? He was like, no. And then he was like, okay, well, you know, have you guys been drinking? Like, we're gonna do like breathalyzer tests and all this other stuff. And I was like, thank God we had not been doing anything. Um, but I don't think that they did breathalyze us. I just believe that they were like, you know, we're gonna um, call you guys as parents. And so they were really like separating us and they were like, okay, two go over there with that uh, police officer and two go over here. So I went over with like one of my friends and I was like looking at her and I was like, she is not gonna make it through the interrogation. She is not gonna <laughs> make it through, she's scared, she's scared. And legit, he was like, uh, what color, He got, I answered all the questions like, what color your eyes, what color your hair, all that, the normal stuff. They got to her and they were like, what color's your eyes? What color's your hair? And she was like, um, um, I'm like, brown, ho. Like, 
It is round. But yeah, my dad ended up grounding me for three months. Um, I think I was the only one out of the group that got grounded yeah, like that. Like I was grounded for three months, no phone, and I could not go anywhere. Like my dad was like, you go to practice, you go to school, and you come straight home. So guys, stay out of jail. So long story short, it was me and my ex-boyfriend and his friend and his date for homecoming or whatever. And I was supposed to um, she was supposed to come to the after party, so we're all at this after party or whatever. My ex-boyfriend and his friend didn't like some dude that his friend had taken, or the girl that his friend was with had dated once before. Anyway, they got in a fight. Fight break out, everybody swinging, things going left and right. And I'm like, oh my God, we're gonna get in trouble, we're gonna get in trouble. And so um, then, you know, we get the 411 that the cops is coming. Mm. My, Me and the girl that um, my ex-boyfriend's friend had taken us his date, walked to the car, mm -hmm. and we should have stayed in the car. Like, we should have stayed in the car because we had debated for so long. We were like, should we go back in? We should have stayed. And, and mind you, I was supposed to be coming to yeah, the party. Yeah, she was supposed to come to the party. But they were not answering. I said, where's the, no, where no, is no, it? Where is it? where is it? I told you where it was. I told you where it was. Well, I couldn't but, find it. No, I told you where it was. And then I said, don't come. The cops are coming. And you were like, okay, okay, okay. So anyway, so everybody's hiding. People are in, like in the house, which is that, that's like the worst thing you can do, hide from the cops, right? Yeah. yeah. And so everybody's outside and they like are moseying people on out. Like the cops are there and they're moseying people on out. Us four, the stupid ones, we get into the shower, get behind the shower curtain and we're just like, dead it, be quiet. Like nobody speaks. And, oh my God. So the cop comes in the bathroom. He's just like waiting there, like just staring, just to see if like anybody's there or whatever. And I'm like being quiet. I'm being so quiet. I'm like, Lord, please, please. I can't go to jail. I can't do it. One of the girls that, the girls that we were with, she started, she was like, and I was like, don't say anything. Like we're being quiet, like I'm mouthing to her like, and she goes, <gasps> I said, oh, like, it's like, did you want to get arrested? I was like, oh, my gosh. So the cop goes, boom, and, like, he breaks open, like, the shower curtain. Like, it was real, like, I was really scared. So they handcuffed all of us. Yes, I was handcuffed. They handcuffed all of us. I'm crying because I'm like, this is so embarrassing at all. But yeah, like, I should not be in this because of you. You right, know what I mean? Right, like, I'm mad. Right, right. And so we all get out there. They they did, like, hold us for a while in the house, like, at the house. But we didn't go to jail or anything. But I was in handcuffs. So. Kids, just, just if you are at a party and feel like you should leave, just go home. Just go home. Go home. <laughs> like, you don't need that. You do not need to be grounded for three months. You don't need to be There's grounded. There's other parties that you or need to Or get the silent treatment right. from your parents. Yeah, like, like you don't yeah. need that. You don't need that. Have you ever broken a bone? I loved PE. Um, soccer actually was my favorite PE sport. Um, and I was playing against one of my friends that was actually in soccer. Like, she actually was on the team. I wasn't. I was just competitive. And um, me and her were coming at each other. Like, I think she had the ball, and I was like, I'm going to swipe this ball from her. The ball is, like, right here. And this is my little toe. It literally is, like, boop. And the ball goes this way. And I was like, dang. And, you know, I couldn't feel it because I was so competitive. I was like, we just lost the ball. So as I, I like started walking over to the side, and I was like, dang, like what in the, I was like, dang, she got some big feet. Like, and you know, my mom's like, baby, your, your toe is blue, purple, and yellow. Like we have to go to the doctor. So yes, they did tell me that I broke my toe and I'm not gonna show you guys my toes because you'd be so upset. But <laughs> this growth plate is smaller than the other toe. So it, her right I, toe I broke is, a, my, is a, is a baby toe. Yeah, so I broke my growth plate in my toe. So yes, I have broken a bone. I have. Have you ever been caught talking to yourself? I don't. I have never been caught. I have never been caught talking to myself. I don't. I have never been caught.
have you ever been on a blind date? No. I'm not. I, those are weird. Like, what I don't, do you expect? I don't think that I have. I don't think I have. Um, want to go on a blind date? Right. Have you ever gone commando? Like in a pool? No, like just wearing clothes, but no. Oh, that's underwear. That's underwear. Not, underwear. not, not skinny dipping. Or skinny dipping. out of a bar <laughs> I had a friend that had my ID because I had spent the night with her the night before and um, I forgot to get it from her and I was like hey can you shoot me a picture of my ID and she was like yeah and so I showed it to the bouncer and I was like hey here's my ID and he was like sorry ma'am sorry ma'am like you can't come in like if the cops come up there it's gonna be over for me and my company I legit was like, all right. And then one of my, I had a this girl's younger sister with me, so she wasn't even old enough anyways to get into the bar. And so she, when he walked this way, I guess she was like, I mean, she took no time. <laughs> like she was like, so then I was like, you know, like we got him, we, you know, we got a drink or whatever. And then the bar man was like, where's your ID? Where's your ID? Where's your ID? <laughs> So then I was like, I was like, um, it's uh, I can't find. He was like, no, nah, the security, security. And then the girl sister was like, we're going, we're going, we're going. So they literally kicked us out. But no, that's the only time that I've been kicked out of a bar. I have never been kicked out of a bar. So I have, I have. All right. Have you ever party for twenty four hours straight? Like when we went to like, um. Miami. That was basically like partying for 24 hours straight. <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. Last day, okay. Okay, so basically we have, we have for 24 because... hours straight. All right, let's get into it. Let's yeah, get I'll into tell it the right last here. part, but you can tell All right, part. so anyway, so we went to Miami for like a week for spring break. And it was so much fun, by the way, it was really fun. Our last night out. So we have been up all day. All yeah. day. Yeah. So we had gotten up that morning and we went out, did a whole bunch of stuff that day. Mm -hmm. And you know, of course we had our uh, drinks during the daytime, like mm -hmm. we're partying and stuff. And then we went to the beach. So of course, you know, that's nothing but partying, doing whatever you gotta do. And so we're partying, partying, partying all day. Then we all get stranded. Right? Because everyone, we did get, we did get stranded. Died. Everybody's phone we died. We had about 10 or 12 people in our group. And yes, and everybody's phone died. Phone died. Like, not one person's so phone we, was alive. Yeah, we legit had so to go into a restaurant and get charge our, charge phones. our phones to order an Uber. <laughs> got dressed, took our pregame, yes. and then got another Uber and went out. Yes. So when and we get to the when we got to we were we were, got to the bar. Yeah, yeah. And the guy in the car, the there was a guy that went with us in the car, and he was like, "Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all have this one. I'm gonna let y'all have this <laughs> night." And I was like, I think I was like so tired. I probably was asleep on the way to the club. Like that's how you know. No, we were. The guy in the Uber was, <laughs> was like, like, "You guys look tired." <laughs> And we should have went we home. Like, and I literally, tired. and it, it was Jalen, another friend. Like they, they just Jalen just never wants to turn down. So I was like, I'm gonna let y'all have this one too. Like I woke up like, yeah, like that sounds like a good idea. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna go back with. I'm gonna go back with our friend. So you know, it, it was like, nah, she coming in. So we went in. We partied for a little bit. Then we were like, okay, we're gonna come back home. So we came back home and we were like, we were like, yeah. And like our other friends were like leaving. They yeah, were like, their, their flight was leaving. Yeah, so home. we were like getting sags. We were like, oh my god, like, this is so much fun. So we were like, bye yeah. y'all. So we then we had like one of our uh, friends uh, like come back with us because we haven't seen him in forever. So mm -hmm. we were like, let's hang out. So we were like really like just turning up, having a great yeah, time. Yeah, turning up, having a good time. And, and just like waiting yeah. until like our stuff was already packed. Yeah, we knew we had a flight at nine. Nine. So we were planning on leaving at seven, at like seven, in the car seven. at seven, yes. ready to go. Yes. And um, so basically, we partied for twenty four hours straight. Right. Because when I and I knew I was like I should not leave her in charge because I was like if I can get us up by six, we can leave by seven. Like I I thought we needed like sometimes you just need an hour to like collect yourself and get yourself together. So I was like, we need that time. When I woke up, it was literally like seven, probably oh two, and I was like, oh my God. Seven. So when we were in the car, me and Jalen both passed out. We're in our just Uber. like, 
we were like this, and which is not safe. Not safe. Uh, but we were like, thank God we're covered. So, right. you know, we, we, I woke up and I was like, Jenna, what time is it? And she was like, it's 8.30. No, I was like getting nervous in the car because I was like, it's so much traffic. It like, was traffic. I don't know. And when we got there, we were running in running. to our gate. Like, the running. lady at the front that was taking our bags, she was right. like, y'all's bags might not make it there on time. And I was like, that's okay. Literally, that's us partying for 24 hours. Yeah. So, you know. We have. We have. We have. We have partied for 24 hours. So, yes, that concludes it. And we hope that you guys got a little bit, like, more involved in, you know, all of our, like, little secrets that we have. We have a lot more, but... We'll We're, not gonna gonna tell. That We're not going to tell. We're not going to tell. Um, But anyway, so we hope that you guys like this video. We have more coming to you soon. Yes. Um, we have a lot. We have a lot of videos, and we're going to really get those out because, you know, we want to connect with you guys mm -hmm. and also gain more of, you know, a community and a following. So yeah. we hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Yes. And Please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, guys. See you later. Bye.